What's happening, people? And once again, welcome back to youtube.com forward slash CubCanTV for this, another edition of Cub Reacts as we jump into another brand new music video. This one, the sound of Ladipo featuring Fireboy DML on Running. This one off his brand new EP, which has been an absolute showstopper. Uh, that is the Providence EP, which is out now. We've already reacted to the collaboration with Amma Ray on this channel, so do go and check that out if you haven't already. As always, my friends, if you want to get more involved in the channel, please do make sure you are hitting that subscribe button, turning notifications on, leaving a like, leaving a comment, and all of that good stuff and just getting involved in the channel in as many ways as you can. Right about now, we're going to jump into this one and give it our analytical breakdown. So break down the production, the uh, vocal performance, the music video as well, and uh, anything else we notice. So hopefully you guys do enjoy this one. Let's go. Woo. Huge baseline to begin with. Woo. Already, already it's super, super creative, using those strings to add a whole different dimension to uh, to, to, to the sound. Uh, massive, massive drums, big, booming kick drum hits that also double um, with the sort of pulsating 808 bass line underneath. You then have, again, the sort of uh, auto-tune intro. This is sounding like it's going to be a big, big tune. Now, I have listened through the EP once. I actually don't remember. Um, I don't remember li specifically listening to anything. I remember I had a quick listen through the full thing um, when it first landed. So I'm looking forward to actually diving into this one properly and examining it for you guys on YouTube more than anything else. There's no time. There's no energy. Woo. I'm just running, running, running. Woo. Sweet white wine. It's such a big There's vocal, man. No Again, utilizing almost like a, an EDM style um, sort of brass stab. That sort of ring at the start of every four bar sounds really, really cool. Again, these big floating um, atmospheric vocals in the background as well, giving the whole thing a real sort of sense of, of depth and space. The whole composition is really, really wide the way it's been put together. This is a fantastic intro. I've got to say, the hook is huge. The video looks super clean. This is a big, big deal. Yeah. Even though the country know the time. I did catch crews echo Miami. If only bad news could be bribed, take all my money. I like my lies sweet, taste like irony. But that's the reason that they vex my nigga. Heavy as the head, but forget my nigga. Ah. Crowned on the bend from the stress, my nigga. Radical flow. It's hard to suppress my liquor. I really like Ladipo, man. I think he comes at this with such a kind of... You can you can hear the kind of emotion in the way he raps. You can hear the sort of passion for what he does in the way he raps. There's a slightly raspy tone to his vocal, which kind of intensifies that. It makes everything a little bit more kind of... Um, like you, you as the listener become kind of intensified by it, which I really like. Again, very sort of hard-hitting um, approach lyric-wise. And again, this instrumental is booming really, really... It must be really fun to rap over um, from a rapper's perspective, being able to find these big sort of booming pockets... Really, really nice. So I'm drinking more wine. Uh -huh. I bought that tea. I'd rather be online than out with company. When I'm turning on my mind, the thought. I'm trying to work out what the horses are for. Life is no joke. We cope with comedy. I really know they see your face. That's why we switch lanes. No, they indicate. Everybody won't blow who they pick the day. Oh. God, when will I be the one they imitate? Really but nice. Again, kind of moving between the flows he's doing and obviously bringing those strings into it as well, giving it a really kind of epic big room feel. All of the instrumentation on this tune really does point to towards that concept of it being like a big, like stadium filling tune. It's a sort of sing along. The hook gives it that sing along value and the rap vocals in the middle give it the more sort of intricate nature. Really, really well put together. As I was saying, I want to know what the horses are there for in the video though. Just trying to work it out. No one can relate when there's no time. There's no energy. I'm just running, running, running. Sweet spot. Such a cool flow, man. Such a huge hook, man. Such a huge hook. The way it's been put together is exceptional. Um, Fireboy's vocals have just got better and better and better over the years. He's now becoming one of these people that you look to go, you you basically seek out to give you a killer hook on a big tune like this. And this is a huge tune. Like, let's be real. This is a huge tune. The uh, lyric video dropped a couple of weeks ago. I heard sort of rumors that there was going to be a big music video for it. I mean, if you've got Fireboy DML involved, you're going to want to drop an actual music video, aren't you? Let's be real. Um, so yeah, I think it's a, it's a perfect tune to do the music video to, especially when it looks this. I love this sort of velodrome sort of um, amphitheater um, sort of vibe we've got going on here with the red stairs and the sort of close-knit um, sort of seating. It looks really, really cool, um, the whole way the tune's been put together. There's no energy. I'm just running, running, running. 
Woo. I love that switch. So, am I right in thinking these are almost like the, the a different version of themselves that they're kind of running from? Is that what it is in the video? Let me know in the comments down below, because I always get the videos wrong. Um, I always get the assumption on the videos of what the videos are actually about wrong. It looks like this is a previous version or a newer version of themselves that they're running from. Let me know how close I am. It's a cool verse, man. So nice. And again, just those sort of floating vocals in the background as well. The sort of sort of vocals. I can't do them myself because I can't sing. But um, it sounds so, so clean, man. And then you've just got his kind of personalized call and respond with himself. Works so, so well. Um, there's very little to not like about this, if that's the correct double double, double negative. Double negative? I can't even speak. I'm losing track. Um, but yeah, the, the whole way the tune's been put together is very, very pleasing to listen to. Cool camera work as well. What's a vaccine to an antidote? Blood, sweat, tears in my engine, no. If you smell success, that's my cologne. Woo. Broke almost every code. Bars, you know. Got fans filling every row. Like a poet with a bars. From the microphone. And that sun god only have knows. There's an artist um, that I'm a big fan of. And he goes by the name Jay Trigger. And he has a very sort of similar, not identical, not copied, but a similar sort of vocal tone and sort of vocal approach to um, to Ladipo. Go and check out Jay Trigger if you haven't already. Um, he's out of uh, Zambia. Uh, top, top Donny. Uh, makes really, really good music as well. Definitely someone. I think I've reviewed a couple of things from him on this channel. But go and check out Jay Trigger if you haven't already. He's definitely someone to watch on the come up. If you're a fan of Ladipo, that is. There's no time. There's no So catchy, man. I'm just running, running, running There's no time. There's no energy. Ah, and then this additional harmony which comes in towards the end just gives it that additional kind of push, that additional like little boost. So, so well done, man. I've got to say, Fireboy has impressed me so much um, over the course of the last sort of year, year and a half. Every single time you hear him now, he's becoming more and more refined. It seems to me like he's taking that sort of Burner Boy route where he now will appear um, as a collaborative artist a lot more and essentially steal the show on every tune. That definitely feels like the direction he's kind of taking. Um... Like out of out of all of the sort of bigger names um, in this sort of Afrobeat world, I definitely think that like Burner is the sort of king of collaboration. I definitely think he's that sort of guy. I definitely think Fireboy could be the next to kind of move in that direction. Um, I'm, as far as I'm aware, Fireboy is quite closely connect connected to Davido. Davido does a fair bit of that as well, so um, that could work. Yeah, I could see it happening. Like, the, the the lineage is there. I'm just running, running, running. I'm running. Woo! Running. The high end of the production as well. I'm just running, running on I've been running for life. Pastor said I've been running from life. Woo. Tank on E, I'm just running. Oh, this this, this instrumental, man. Let me on wine, cause it's heavy all night. Again, this is something a little bit out of the box. Um, I feel from both of them, the the sort of uh, the the rhythm of the instrumental is very different. It's a lot more sort of hip hop focused, um, and then on top of that, you've got these big soundscapey string breakdowns, which just again make it sound like a film soundtrack more than anything else. And it's so cool to kind of hear them both sound both so composed and so sort of well fitting over over the instrumental. It doesn't sound like they've had to force their way in. It sounds like they're 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 supposed to be there, which is what makes a tune sound um, complete a lot. The time to me. I don't want any on my. You can offer me on. I'm just running, running, running on. Yeah. But you know Super that. smooth. So it's smooth. Like mm. What a uh, tune, and what a video. That one is really like the video. Super, super clean. Really well produced, that one. The sounds of Ladipo alongside Fireboy DML with running. Love the fact that Fireboy got a full verse as well and wasn't there just for the uh, just for the hook. But overall, I think these two made a bang together. I've got to say, it's one of the, clearly one of the biggest songs on the album. It's one of the tunes that's getting a real push in regards to the album. Remmer's on the album as well. Amaray's on there. I really like the Amaray tune. But this one definitely has some star quality about it. Got to say, big up Ladipo. Sick to see him continuing 
continuing on this journey and hopefully this album continues to get um, as much appreciation as it deserves. Now, if you did enjoy this reaction, breakdown, technical analysis of the tune, please make sure you are hitting that subscribe button on the right-hand side of the page, turning notifications on, leaving a like, leaving a comment, all of that good stuff. We're trying to hit 15k by the end of the year. If we can do that, that would be absolutely spectacular. So please do try and get involved on uh, that front. And obviously, if you have any requests for the channel, please get them in via the comment section down below. I am trying to catch up with everyone. I've got nearly a year of backlog to catch up with. So please do leave your comments down below. Even if I don't get around to it straight away, I will try in the long run. Um, and I do read every comment that comes on the page. So please do get involved. That's it from me, though. Enjoy the rest of your Wednesday, and we shall see you all next time. Peace. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel right now, Cobb Camp TV. Stay locked.